When I first came here, I think I was probably like 16 years old. I had no idea what I was coming to. Well, my first class was art welding, so it was a little scary. Um, also, I was a little shy because I was the only girl and I was like 12, and I had never even known what welding was. I worked with Fuego for two years during the summer, and I worked with the youth classes. Now I'm a teacher assistant for the summer programs, and I help out in the mid classes and the art bike program. All three of us graduated from the uh, internship program, but this program is actually branching out into like a bigger vision. We're building a, uh, a gate for City Slickers, and it is an artsy, cool looking gate. <laughs> It's really amazing to get a project of this scale and with the, this much design leeway and, and opportunity. Uh, so there's a lot of planning, there's a lot of thinking. You know, attention to detail I think is going to be the big thing. And, and I don't know how many times they've had to make something square that, that is weighted properly, works on hinges, fits together. We went to City Slickers Farms and we talked to the executive directors and we discussed what they wanted for their gate. I went there and I saw like this vast plain and I could see like all the people that could actually go there. We started with a design process. We all sat around a table for a few hours and drew out sketches, talked about ideas. As an artist, sharing ideas I guess is really important because you don't want to get stuck in your own state of mind came out to be all three of us into like a, into this project, so that's the good thing about it too. The confidence building that it brings to be able to problem solve through these difficult situations or tasks that they have to do improves everything else that they do. This plan, this mm -hmm. plan, so we try to make it more look natural. is to make it 3D, so this would be the, the wings with the head, and then the body will go underneath, and then there will be welds that'll make it pop out and be 3D. We're gonna give it some antennas and some eyes and a smile so it'll be playful. Like before it seemed like nothing was like really together, and now everything's like, like I see it. it exposed me to a real life work environment. It pretty much set me up to go into a job. But it's about the new generation of, of people coming up, their skills, what they can do, and how the history of Oakland has influenced them. This game we're regular for the City Slicker Farms. It's probably gonna be the best coaches I've ever made. It's a permanent piece that's gonna be in Oakland, so it's pretty much saying like we were here. When you see all your ideas together, it's just like, whoa, we created that, like that, that's our thing. 